but we came to have lunch and to tour the hotel. Renita Schaffner and her friends are excited to tour the newly renovated Tulsa Club Hotel. The entryway was very reminiscent. I think maybe the marble is still uh, like the original, so we're eager to see what it looks like. The ladies remember the Art Deco building's glory days. Well, I've been here years and years ago when I was much younger. Well, it was the end place to come for all kinds of events. I think it's very cool. But there was a time when the building wasn't so cool. The building closed in 94 and it sat vacant between 94 and 2015. During that 21 year stretch, it deteriorated, fell victim to vandals and multiple fires. We wanted to make sure that every aspect of this building that we could save was saved. Pete Patel headed up the $36 million renovation of the Tulsa Club building, recreating it into a boutique hotel, lounge, restaurant, and ballroom, restoring much of this Tulsa treasure to its original grandeur. It's, it's an honor for us to bring back a lot of those memories and a lot of the old history here. Original terrazzo floors were saved and cleaned. Ornate plaster molds copied from pieces that survived years of neglect and flames. Even the chandeliers in the famous Grand Ballroom were recreated. There is a lot of history and a lot of memories and a lot of pictures that we used to replicate a lot of the stuff in this building. More modern touches were also added into all that Art Deco decadence. We were able to take a lot of the old, original 1920s, 30s, 40s and to incorporate a modern flair to a guest room or a gathering area. This is what the eighth floor looked like just a few years ago. And as you can see today, it is a lot different, but that graffiti isn't gone forever. And we were able to take pictures of this graffiti that some of it was very, very well done. Um, and we incorporated that graffiti into the artwork into all of our, our guest rooms. There are 96 beautiful rooms in the hotel with 63 different configurations. The configurations are all different. Some are skinny, some are wide, some are tall. Um, it's, it's, it's just very unique. The bathrooms are bright and modern with vintage style tile giving a nod to the building's history. All the designs create a special atmosphere for everyone. It's our job to make sure that this hotel is delivered with nothing but elegance and luxury to not only our out-of-town visitors, but our local community as well. It's exciting to see that they've renovated it and kept the charm. You know, it's nice to see it wasn't torn down. Giving this old building another chance and making it a great place to discover Oklahoma. It sure is. It's a great place to discover Oklahoma. In downtown Tulsa, I'm Jason Grubbs.